So going into the final leg, what was the key to your success? <clears throat> what gave you the edge over the other two teams? It's interesting because we actually talked about our strategies uh, for choosing challenges and we had come up with a list of questions that we would ask ourselves when we got, when we opened a challenge. The first thing was, is this a physical challenge or a mental, intellectual challenge? Um, and the second thing was, have we done it before? And so if we had any sort of strength or experience, then we would choose that. Um, because we knew that we could get through it faster. Yeah, we took inspiration from Mickey and Pete, where they were kind of under the radar, they never got U-turned, they were friends with pretty much everyone, and they ended up winning the whole race, and we thought, well, let's stay at, my, I was like, let's stay at the back of the pack, and he was like, no, we're gonna be at the front of the pack, and then like, when we actually ended up in the back of the pack, we were like, this is horrible, we don't yeah. like this, like, doesn't feel don't good, like it. Retreat, almost retreat. being eliminated, <laughs> so. You know, as the race progressed, we learned more and more about challenges, about ourselves, about the other teams. And by the time we got to Saskatchewan, I felt like we really hit our stride. We learned what winning feels like. We learned the importance of being in front of the pack. And by that point, we had developed a system for choosing challenges, communicating, and most importantly, selecting caps. And that's ultimately what got us the victory. And what we knew is that the one is not to get eliminated in the previous legs before the finale. Um, it doesn't matter how many wins that you have before the finale. And the only thing that matters is that you win the finale. So this race, unlike other sports, where maybe the number of wins actually matters in a certain set of time that you're playing this sport, um, <laughs> the only one that matters is when you win the race. Yeah. The finale and <laughs> that's what we did <laughs> and in fact having challenges and difficulties in the race was something that gave us an advantage because we knew what it felt like to come from the back of the pack and we also knew what it felt like when a challenge was getting difficult and so when we started feeling those sensations or if we started going in that direction during a challenge we could mentally and physically and like spiritually regroup so that we could calibrate to the front of the pack.